Hello, I am Alexandre de Croo, I'm Belgium Vice Prime Minister and Minister of Cooperation Development and also of the Digital Agenda. I am pleased to share with you some thoughts about one of the most exciting and encompassing challenges we face at present and in the near future. Two years ago, all the 193 members of the United Nations adopted the famous Sustainable Development Goals. These goals will inspire and guide our efforts for promoting worldwide development during the years 2016 till 2030. The SDGs have the potential to unite all stakeholders around clear objectives. They promote knowledge sharing, mutual learning and enable an open dialogue. The SDGs are everybody's agenda. The 17 goals and the 169 targets require active inv involvement of all actors, from NGOs to the private sector, from policymakers to every global citizen. Nobody can stay at the sidelines. I am convinced that digitalization, ICT, innovation and connectivity are key enablers for sustainable change and are therefore in a unique position to contribute to all of the goals. We are working on several projects where different technologies are used to promote certain SDGs. For example, SDG 8 on sustained, inclusive and sustainable economic growth. Farmers receive personalized commercial and technical advice on their smartphones based on the state of their crops. This allows them to increase their productivity as well as to get a better price for their crops. Another example is on SDG 3 on healthy lives and the promotion of well-being for all at all ages. There, in Guinea, for example, big data is being used in the fight against the Ebola virus through schemes of displaced people to prevent another disease outbreak. Our last example is SDG 5 on achieving gender equality. In Burkina Faso, we support an interactive platform that informs, informs women and youth on the subject of sexual and reproductive health and rights. Because of a taboo surrounding these issues, they are often afraid to ask questions to other people. Digitalization really helps here to get the information where it is most needed. There are many more examples that I could give, like mobile health solutions or wearables, online learning programs for children and adults, mobile apps and social media for gender equality, advanced data collection and analytics, smart city solutions, remote sensing technologies to track climate change and weather patterns or disaster production and early warning systems. But I believe the picture is clear. I am excited by the challenge set by this Hack the Goals initiative and I'm curious for the innovative solutions that you will bring forward. The best ideas from each country will be presented at the Innovation Fair that will take place in the autumn of this year. Happy hacking and may the innovative ideas 